Good morning, good morning, good morning. Yes, uh, welcome to the Daily Grind. How you doing out there this morning? Good, I hope, I hope you're having a great morning. Hope you have a great day today, by golly, all day long. Let's get to it. Serenity. How easily do you give up your serenity? Do you give it up at the drop of a hat? As soon as somebody does something in traffic you don't like, boom, serenity's out the window. Angry, mad, yapping. How about if somebody looks at you? Do you give up your serenity? Somebody says something you don't like, there goes my serenity out the window. That can make for a long day doing that. And it seems like people do it quite easily today. You're sitting at a light and you look over at somebody and they're like, What the hell are you looking at? They're all, it's like, dude, relax. I just looked over there. At nothing. It just calm it down, big boy. Calm it down. Uh, somebody does something you don't like and people lose their mind. They just, how easily do you give up your serenity? It To me, it's just not worth it. It's not waste ruining my whole day by giving up my serenity over something something simple like that. I mean, I used to do it all the time. I don't anymore. My serenity is way more important than getting angry over something silly. And and people do it all the time. You go into your uh, go into the grocery store or something, and they don't have something that you want. They ran out or whatever, and you get all bent out of shape, hauling and screaming at them. Cashier for what? It ain't their fault. They didn't. They didn't do it. Uh, sometimes my vendors don't have what I want, or maybe it takes longer to get than what they said. I used to get mad about that and get upset and lose my serenity. Not anymore. It's like it's, I, it's beyond my control. If something is beyond my control, there isn't much sense in me losing my serenity over it. And if I am losing my serenity quite easily, then there's something out of whack. Something's out of balance. I'm not spiritually fit. I've lost my connection. Something. I need to get back to whatever I was doing before so that I can manage to stay serene and calm and uh in this world today especially i mean it was going on before covid but since covid hit it seems like it's even worse people just are so angry about everything it's like geez calm down it's it's not that big a deal you know life is still going on we all gotta we all gotta live on this planet together uh might as well try to do our part to just be nice to each other that that certainly is helpful i can tell you that and uh, ask yourself a question, too. When you feel like you're getting mad or you're starting to lose your serenity, or, or I should say give it up because it's how easily do you give it up, ask yourself one simple question. How important is this? Is this important enough for me to lose my serenity and be angry half the day or all day or even an hour? Is it that important? If it's not, then let it go. Just let it go. That takes practice sometimes. I know this. Uh, what do I do? I just keep praying until it's gone. I say the serenity prayer. God grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change. I ask myself, can I change it? And if not, what can I do about it? The courage to change the things I can. Like I said, if I can change it, I'll change it. If I can't, then I can change my attitude. That's it. And the wisdom to know the difference. And when I say that little serenity prayer and I really think about it, It'll help me calm right down and gain my serenity back and let go of whatever the crap is that was bothering me. So that's a good little prayer to say when something's going on and the, the, the question to ask yourself is how important is this? Is this important enough for me to lose my serenity over? If it's not, then let it go and get about your day. Uh, there's going to be more stuff coming down the road, good, bad, and indifferent. Just get through the day and you, you'll be much happier if you hang on to your serenity. That's my story. I'm sticking to it. I hope you have a great day, and I'll see you tomorrow. Over.